Istanbul and Mexico City are two congested cities. There was no solution, there was a, a negative cycle in which both cities said there's no money for major investments, so we stay like that. Metrobus proved that these systems can attract big crowds with a good quality of service, that that demand is attractive to the private sector. Once Metrobus was introduced, all of a sudden we had, you know, the restaurants started to come back to Surgentes, people started walking on the sidewalks, the street became more alive. Es una alternativa más que puede contribuir a que la gente se mueva más rápido, a que vaya en una forma más cómoda, más eficiente, más segura y pueda tener esta alternativa para poder contribuir a su movilidad. Un problema que hay en la ciudad es esta cantidad excesiva de automóviles, por lo tanto, pues las emisiones y los tiempos que dedica la gente para hacer estos recorridos es muy muy grande. In order to improve the air quality in a city, you have to act on transport. And by that I mean you have to reduce the use of private vehicles and increase the use of public transport. The Metrobus in Mexico, it's healthier because it, it, it tends to be there less time, so the exposure to pollutants is reduced. Metrobus introduce los autobuses de bajas emisiones, introduce los sistemas inteligentes, introduce la tarjeta de recaudo. In Metrobus, we have around 900,000 people being transported every day. Not only because they have to use it, sometimes it's also because they decide to use it, which is very important. El sistema lo uso bastante, ya que es un medio que me lleva rápidamente a los lugares donde yo quiero ir. Es cómodo, es seguro y es rápido. Lo que se ha visto en la aplicación y en la, el desarrollo de corredores de RT en términos de la seguridad vial es que hay una mejora muy importante. Se calcula que la reducción de eh, accidentes en estos corredores es hasta el 80% después de la implantación. Hoy es mucho más seguro, es mucho más seguro caminar o cruzar en un corredor donde hay un metrobús y la gente sabe dónde para, la gente sabe dónde está el paseo patonal. Cada vez vemos más bicicletas, cada vez vemos más personas que van al trabajo en transporte público. Yo creo que Metrobús ha sido uno de los proyectos que le ha cambiado la cara a la ciudad. Istanbul Metrobus is 52 kilometers with 42 stations and fully dedicated single continuous line. We carry 750,000 people in a day. Through the BRT system in Istanbul, people save two and eight days over the course of a year. So we can say that they receive their February back. <laughs> As you can imagine, with a city of about 15 million, it's really hard to get around with cars. To cross the bridge from Asia to Europe, with car it would take one and a half hour. With Metrobit it's only like 15 minutes. When the BRT was introduced, accident numbers fell with between 30 and 40 percent. So this is a huge uh, saving in accidents. It's a huge uh, saving in money terms as well. In the first phase of Metrobus, over 20,000 cars were removed from the road. More than 600 tons of carbon emissions are reduced. The BRT has a big advantage that it's a, a relatively cheap option for a, ma a mass transport system. Other transit systems are not as widely used or well perceived as metrobus. I think this, the city is in a new era.